Katoka International Airport IATA, ACC, ICAO, DGAA, in Accra, the capital of Ghana, is an international airport, and has the capacity for large aircraft such as the Airbus A380. The airport is operated by Ghana Airports Company Limited GACL, which has its offices on the airport property. GACL was established as a result of the decoupling of the existing Ghana Civil Aviation Authority GCAA in line with the modern trends in the aviation industry. In 2014, the airport saw 2.547 million passengers. It presently serves as a base for domestic and regional operator Africa World Airlines. It is the sole international airport in Ghana. The airport consists of three passenger terminals, named Terminal 1, Terminal 2 and Terminal 3. Terminal 2 serves only domestic flights, while Terminal 3 serves regional, international and long-haul operators. Terminal 1 is presently no longer in use after migration of all flights to Terminals 2 and 3. There is also a VVIP terminal used for diplomatic flights, and a military terminal used for military operations. History The airport was originally a military airport used by the British Royal Air Force during World War II. The facility was handed over to civilian authorities after the war. A development project was launched in 1956 by President Kwame Nkrumah to reconfigure the structure into a terminal building. The project was completed in 1958, turning the military base into an airport with a capacity of 500,000 passengers per year. The airport was originally named Accra International Airport. In 1969, the Accra International Airport was renamed Katoka International Airport, in honor of Lieutenant General Emmanuel Kwasi Katoka a member of the National Liberation Council. Katoka was killed in an abortive coup attempt at a location which is now the forecourt of the airport. The airport company was registered in January 2006 and commenced trading on 1 January 2007, tasked with the responsibility for planning, developing, managing and maintaining all airports and aerodromes in Ghana, namely Katoka International Airport and domestic airports at Kumasi's Kumasi International Airport, Sanyani's Sanyani Airport and Sakandi Takaradi's Takaradi Airport. Construction officially commenced on 1 March 2016 on a new $274 million Terminal 3 which is capable of handling 5 million passengers a year, with an expansion potential of up to 6.5 million, and will be equipped with new state-of-the-art facilities. The new Terminal 3 will handle 1,250 passengers an hour, equipped with three business lounges, large commercial and retail area and six boarding bridges. The terminal opened to passengers on 15 September 2018. Controversy over airport name There has been considerable debate over the years as to whether it was fitting to rename the airport from Accra International Airport to Katoka International Airport after General Katoka. Many argue that the airport was built by Nkrumah, and that it is not fitting to rename it after Katoka, who led a coup to overthrow Nkrumah's government. <inaudible> <inaudible> Airlines and destinations Passenger Notes <inaudible> 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 Carat 1, this flight operates between Lagos and Accra. Air Namibia has fifth freedom rights to carry traffic between Accra and Lagos. Cargo Accidents and incidents On 5 June 2000, a Ghana Airlink Fokker F-27 en route from Tamale to Accra crashed on approach to Katoka International Airport. Six people were killed. On 28 January 2009, a Ghana International Airlines Boeing 757 operating from Accra to London Gatwick, United Kingdom, with 96 passengers and nine crew reported anomalies with the control systems when climbing out of Accra. 
The crew declared a mayday and made a safe return to Katoka International Airport where the remains of a beetle-like creature were discovered to be obstructing the left pitot system. On 2 June 2012, an Allied Air Boeing 727 cargo aircraft operating from Lagos to Accra on behalf of DHL with four crew overshot the runway while landing in heavy rain. At least 12 people on the ground were killed. The four crew all survived. On 10 January 2015 an ASCII Airlines Boeing 737-43 QSF leased to Ethiopian Airlines, was damaged beyond repair in a landing accident and runway excursion at Katoka International Airport, Accra, Ghana. The aircraft was written off and there were no fatalities. <laughs> 